What up, G Nation? We're here uh, in the infamous G Nation channel, taking you today. Kind of different route. We're working on the Gerardo collection, winter collection. You saw Gabe. You've seen him before. We got Adam behind. Yo, 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 yo. Brandon helping out today with uh, the photos and everything. And Drew over there, he's been helping out as well. Um, so today, uh, we're just here getting all the product images done. And we'll probably go eat after this. Chipotle. Chipotle. Oh, <laughs> that's it. Most likely. And we got back day. Uh, but you know, hey, business is business. So we got to keep it pushing. Um, so we're just going to finish this up. Hope you're enjoying it. All right, G Nation, we just wrapped up product images. How long, how long did that take? An hour know. and a half, two hours? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, But obviously we messed around the whole time and we actually worked to make sure every little detail looks good in pictures, the actual product uh, fits good and we get, you know, we throw like um, kind of feedback in the air. Gabe obviously killed it over there with the, <laughs> thanks for the flash. <laughs> he killed it with the, uh, you know, the pictures. He does mainly the product images. Brandon joined us today for, like I mentioned earlier, he modeled a lot of the pictures. He made, look, I've been doing this for Gerardo Collection for like three years now. And in his first time, he made the products look better than I think I have ever. So he killed it. <laughs> Adam killed it behind the camera. Drew was a big help here as well. Um, so we're excited, we just finished this up. So every release, this is kind of something what we do. We get together and we kill it uh, and plan and give feedback. And that's why literally every drop we make has gotten better. Um, so it's, you know, the, the great thing and the, the cool thing about owning a business is there's no one on top of you telling you what to do, which is great, but you gotta remember a lot of that responsibility falls on yourself. So the great thing I like about owning a business is I, I depend on myself, so I'm always trying to improve what I give to you guys, the quality, um, presentation and everything. And no one's telling me I have to do that, but it's something that I like to do and I put that responsibility on myself. And that's something I think that a lot of people fail to understand when they have their own business or when they're trying to chase or create their own thing, it falls on you. Uh, so, but I know I have a huge support team here and they're helping me kill it. The clothes is amazing. And I can't wait for you to have it real soon, G Nation. Um, I don't know if the clothes will be out by the time you see this video, but if it, if it is out, the date will be there. Um, so you'll know. Anyways, we're about to go eat, work out, and that's our life. <laughs> <laughs> and go to sleep. So uh, we'll see you later. Probably either at the restaurant or at the gym. Thank you for joining us here at the studio today. This is G Nation. Wow, I can't believe it. it's been three years since I created and launched Gerardo Collection. What you just saw was probably one of my favorite things to do, and that is getting the launches ready for you guys. Uh, but let me give you a little background story as you see all these amazing shots and everything. Um, you know, I started Gerardo collection on my own with approximately $2,000.
Um, and at the time I was sponsored by a clothing company and I was like, you know what? I'm not too sure how long a sponsored company is gonna keep me around. It could be three years, four years, but I know for sure it's not gonna be a lifetime. Um, and as you can tell, and you've seen, there's a lot of athletes and fitness uh, enthusiasts who jump from brand to brand. And I, I did not wanna be, do that. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to start my own apparel company. And I have no idea what I'm getting into, but I do have a passion for lifting and I do have a passion for looking good and feeling good. So I created Gerardo Collection. I started with about $2,000. I invested in some clothes and I started pushing uh, my clothing line. I think it started more on the merch side, but then little by little, as I got better, I started to transition into an apparel line <laughs> and stepping away from the merchandise aspect of it. So um, one of the reasons I feel like I wanted to talk about this is because I do feel like owning a business and having a business is so much alike making gains. One of the most important things in making gains in the gym, which is what you guys see me do all the time, is consistency. So I was able to take that mentality, which was built already from working out to start my own business. Um, don't get me wrong. It has not been easy. Just like my workouts are not easy. Having my own business has not been easy, but I started it because I saw a gap missing for a clothing line that, um, fit my needs, which was something that I can wear to the gym and then also go out. And when I'm out, you're not going to think, damn, he's wearing gym clothes. I wanted to create something that was, um, something that when you saw me, you don't know if I'm wearing gym clothes or not. And that was the gap that I aimed for, obviously targeting men. And once I had that plan, I went going, you know, um, I want to say within a year and a half, you know, I started with $2,000 and I was already at a six figure sales. Um, you know, six figures is uh, 100,000 to 999,000. I'll give you guys a range. I was over right about, I want to say a quarter um, of a million, you know, at my peak. But the thing that's funny is I had this injury, which happened as the company was booming. And obviously the injury took me out for a while. It took me out mentally and took my motivation. And I just, you know, I was still able to keep it going, but definitely the company did not um, flourish like it should have almost like the same way my physique was not flourishing and I lost my motivation, uh, not only in the gym because I was depressed, but also with businesses and all this. And, and um, this is where I learned like the consistency of making gains in the business is so alike, um, you know, and, and it was all learning experience. But I feel like the past year I've been able to pick everything back up. The business is doing amazing, um, you know, and the fact that I was able to turn you know, by myself, I don't have any investors. I don't have anything, you know, this company and this, this idea that I had into what it is and what I'm able to do. I put in the hours, I put in the time I put in, um, you know, the investments, the investments that I've needed. I have people who believe in the brand and, and, and I believe that as long as you do something with good intentions, not try to cut corners and you consistently push, just like you do in the gym, you can't cut, cut corners and you consistently push, the results will come. It's not gonna be easy, it's not gonna be immediate, but it's just about, you know, obviously working smarter and not harder and, and always adjusting. Um, so I think, you know, that is one of the biggest things, um, it, especially if you're trying to start a business, is you can compare it to the gym and, you know, simplify it. If you have a big problem, you have to learn how to simplify it and look at it in its basic form. And having a business and making gains can be related in so many ways. And luckily, I, you know, I use my years of training to basically apply that to the business. 
The crazy thing is, before I even saw a dollar from any businesses in fitness or apparel, you know, sponsorships, I spent six to seven years training, six to seven years buying supplements, doing this, uh, gym memberships, you know, shows, all this. I'm talking about thousands of dollars before I even saw one penny. Hundreds of hours in the gym before I saw one penny. You know, but at the end of the day, it wasn't, I was never doing it because I was chasing money. I was doing it because it was my passion. Just like when I'm doing this clothing, it's my passion to create amazing clothes that I can wear to the gym and that I can wear out. And that's why I'm so picky. That's why when you guys get this apparel, you guys are blown away. That's why when I do my program, it's a passion. I don't just do it for the money. That's why, uh, you know, everyone's like, dude, why are your prices so amazing? Because we're not doing it for the money. It's our passion. We want to help people. We want to help people look better. And I love doing this. So we'll, I think the biggest things you have to take away from this, you have to love what you do. You got to have a passion for it and you have to be patient and break it down. Uh, and when I break things down, especially business wise, I break it down to the gym. It's going to be painful. It's going to take time. It's going to hurt. You can't cut corners. But at the end of the day, you'll get the results if you do it right. Um, so thank you for watching a little behind the scenes here. This is G Nation. Let's finish this workout out. I'll see you in a bit. That was one hell of a video, huh? What'd you think, Adam? It was dope, bro. That was dope, right? We brought him in. They got to see a little behind the scenes and hear about GC, how business ties to the gym, how business ties to the gains, and how that mentality to improve here, and take it with you everywhere else. G Nation, I want to thank you for all the support through all the years, um, especially with Gerardo Collection, now with GG Fit Training. Whoa. <laughs> and, uh, Always having my pack, even when I'm about to fall, <laughs> I always get back up. You know me? <laughs> the winter collection, a lot of the pieces you've seen me wearing will be a part of that. I have one here, like the hoodie. Um, Adam's wearing his today. Um, but it's something that I've, I'm very proud of, something that I put all my energy to. And I know you guys that, that order have seen that. Uh, so I look forward to doing your orders and also hearing your feedback. Here in the G Nation channel, you know it's G Nation Wednesdays. So we appreciate your support. We appreciate everything you do for us. Um, you know, killed this workout, all about the pump, all about making money, following your passions. And we don't chase money, we chase our passions and the money follows us. That's the mentality I have with all this. But you know one thing, this is G Nation. We out. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> There you go, help him out. <laughs> He's a little nervous. Help him out. <laughs> He's stupid. He's a little nervous. <laughs>